Hey guys, welcome back to some more Xeno Gears. So, as per usual, it's early in the morning for me. Um, yeah, so Faye and Ellie got picked up by a salvager boat. Hey, m maybe Rex works on here. Mr. Salvager Rex. <laughs> I miss Rex. I don't miss his voice actor, but I miss Rex. <laughs> Anyways, <coughs> let's see what's going on here. I was so surprised that there are people living afloat on the vast sea. On top of that, you are with two gears. That's unheard of. Thanks. You helped us out. You'd better thank the captain. The one who gave the order for us to pull you two floaters out was the captain of the Thames. The Thames? Captain? The Thames. The city at the sea. That is where you are now. The captain here is a bit of a strange old chap. You'll see when you meet him. That's not to say he's a bad old blighter. Um, what about our gears? Don't worry about it. We put them aside. Oh, we put them inside the Thames through the supply dock. Seawater got inside, so we'll take some si some time to fix them. You're repairing them for us? Pretty strange for us to be so nice. I bet that's what you're thinking. But really, we had no choice because it's the captain's orders. Well, I have to go now. I'm a busy guy, you know. Come to the bridge after you've looked around the ship a while. I'm sure the captain would want to meet you. He kind of reminds me of the guy from, uh... What's it called? The boat. Not the boat. The Yggdrasil. <laughs> you know the one penguin dude? What's his name? I forget his name. Ah, uh, it'll come back to me later. One of Bart's, uh... One of Bart's pilots. Uh, hey, what's wrong? I feel like I've seen that guy somewhere before. Yeah, is it the same guy? I don't know. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, anyways, let's go. Uh, are there any shops around here? Uh, no, we haven't met the captain yet. I am a man of the sea. Hey, wait, oops. Oh, yeah, that's what the captain always does. <laughs> He's always like, I am a man of the sea. It's over here. I still need more practice. Uh, nah, these guys aren't really saying too much. I guess I'll save real quick. I have no idea when the last time I actually saved was. Alright. Let's, let's go see what's good on this boat. Uh, I guess I'll just run out here. But yeah, as you can see, <laughs> we were just in this little little area right here. Um, man, this is a pretty fucking huge boat. That one guy said it was like a floating country or something. It, it looks like it. Um, okay, so I'm trying to remember. Here, we got the screw elevator. We got the supply entrance. Uh, let's go to the screw elevator. Because I think I remember where the captain is, but I kind of don't at the same time. Oh, I feel sick. Please don't spit it. Don't spit it. <laughs> well, I have to. We got to get to the freaking... Uh, I'm guessing he's going to be in the bridge. We've upset the poor drunk guy. <laughs> he's just sitting there hungover and he's like, Don't spin, please. <laughs> Don't make me go through this. But yeah, anyways, here's the captain. I kind of remembered that he was in the bridge somewhere. Uh, hold on, I'm just yawning. <laughs> Fuck, I don't have a voice for the captain. I'm gonna have to think one up real quick. You're the two winos who floated in with the gears. I don't really like wandering around. Ah, well, don't take it so badly. For us, anything we pull out of the sea is treasure. And you're a really big important treasure. We were really careful. Um, thanks for helping. 
What a pretty lady. Oh, don't make that face. I won't bite. I'll return your gears to you squeaky clean. Why are you being so kind? That's because I am a man of the sea. <laughs> You're probably starved. I'll get you some food. Ah, Hans. That Hans? Is that his name? The penguin dude? I'll welcome the guests. You take care of the rest. Yes, sir. Just don't overdo it. Of course I know that. How can you be so calm? The captain and everyone are so irresponsible. Ha! Huh, yeah, yeah. Let me go and get things ready. What? Who's that? They don't look like so, such bad people. Nah, these guys are pretty cool, actually. <laughs> They're just laid-back uh, sailors. Who like to drink, apparently. This guy's walking around with a bottle. Oh, uh, isn't this the beer hall? <laughs> nope, you're like... I think you're one door off, buddy. Here's the beer hall. <laughs> Men are stupid. They're so happy with that crap. What? Booze? Nah. Booze is alright. If you're talking about video games, if you're talking about video games and anime, then uh, you're right. <laughs> I am kind of... Wait, what did she say? I gotta go back and read what she said. Men are stupid. They're so happy with that crap. Yeah. I'll be happy with a video game and an anime any day. I can live off that shit. Just give me food, video games, and yeah, I'm set. I'll set. I'll be set till my retirement. Ah. All right. Anyways. Oh, there's the captain. I was looking for him. <laughs> Took you a while, but things aren't ready yet. Hey, hurry it up. Don't make our guests wait. Sorry, there's no place to sit around here. But isn't it the view just splendid from here? This beer hall is the Thames Pride. You probably think it's a bit peculiar having a beer hall right next to the bridge, but it's fine by me. If you don't take time in life to enjoy a drink, you'll be swallowed by the waves of anxiety. Responsibly. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Be responsible. Don't... Don't make alcohol your, uh, your reason to fix your anxiety, or else next thing you know, you got, you got a bit of a problem on your hand. You'll feel like you can't deal with anything without, like, substances. It's not good. Aw, oh, man. Alright. But we don't have time. Okay, I already read this. Are you always wandering the seas like this? Well, normally. There is that crane that fished you out. We used... We used that or the gears to pull up the treasure from the sea. We're salvages! <laughs> We're salvages! Rex! Where are you? Recently, however. There has been almost no treasure. Just little things. Since we've started the big job, well, that's all we've had. Big job? Oh, that's a job for the ethos. The ethos is planning a really big salvage next. Well, you know it can't be good if the ethos is involved. <laughs> oh, shit. You guys on the Thames are getting yourselves into some shit now. I don't know the details, but it looks like we'll be searching for some buried treasure. Why is the ethos involved? Who knows, but we're really dependent on the ethos to buy our stuff. So, it won't look good if we turn the job down. Oh god, that doesn't sound good. Well, dinner's finally ready. Let's eat. We've got Sona. That's not it. This type. It matches with the Ave pirate ship, Yggdrasil. Wait, what's going on here? Are these... Uh, are the fucking... Are these bitches gonna try and blow up the Yggdrasil now? 
Is that what they're trying to do? I don't really remember. <laughs> I don't remember. Angel. Wasn't she sunk in another battle? There's no record of it sinking. We were too busy fighting that red gear to try and confirm it. Then, there is a chance that it did not sink. I believe the data shows the Yggdrasil was the carrier for that gear. One moment. Yes, that is correct. Excellent. Give me the controls. Excellent. What are you planning on doing? Sink it, of course. She will never trouble the commander again. Wait. The commander's orders were to investigate the disappearance of that flying battleship. We can't deviate from our mission. Besides, we are low on fuel and need to refuel. We have enough. I'll take her down. Ah, uh, once you start, there is no stopping you, is there? I hope you know what fighting in water is. I hope you know that fighting in water is totally different than fighting on land. Of course. Sorry, Kelvena. Oh, speaking of Kelvena, I don't know if they'll show her face again, but I think she's... Uh, I think Bridget is a reference to her. Just the way her eyes are closed and she's all like blue and shit. At least that's that's what I think. I was gonna mention that like five seconds ago when you could see her portrait, but yeah, you get the point. She looks like Bridget a little bit. Um, <clears throat> Bridget from Xenoblade Chronicles Two, that is. I don't know any other Bridgets, but I'm just me. I'm just clarifying <laughs> the one from Xenoblade Two. <clears throat> I know you haven't eaten for a while, but how can you eat so much? <laughs> this is great. This is great. I like how you eat. You weren't drifting around for nothing. Men have courage and have appetites. <laughs> Faye, did you eat the whole fucking kitchen? Did we just shake? You're just imagining it. You're just imagining it. I don't think so. Captain, your first mate is calling you. Got it. I'm on the way. Looks like something's up. Sorry, but I have to return to the bridge. But please, enjoy yourselves. Wait, what's going on? What's causing the shaking? Is that Dominia? Is that Dominia down there causing shit? I thought they were tr trying to fuck up the Yggdrasil, not the Thames. Ellie, is that a water sprout? It's too far. I can't see very well, but it looks like a battle. Let's go to the bridge, too. Okay. Wait, what's going on? I don't remember this. Oh, wait. This is the uh, infirmary. Uh, she said we gotta go back to the bridge? Alright. Wait, why are we in the elevator? Ah, whatever. I'll take this way around. I'll be honest, guys, I'm a little bit, uh, confused. I don't remember this part that well. They've got guts starting to fight next to the Thames. It gets my blood boiling. Hey, Hans, I haven't fired the big gun in a long time. How about we take a shot or two? Are you kidding? Why get the Thames involved in a, sh in a fight between sides who are neither enemies nor allies? And that big gun is nothing but a useless piece of junk you tacked onto the Thames in a drunken stupor. You just don't understand the code of the men of the sea. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? It seems like a submarine is under attack. Oh no, that's what's going on? So that's why we're shaking. I thought Dominia and Calvena were attacking the Thames for a minute. I was like, why? But no, they're just attacking the nearby Yggdrasil, I guess. <laughs> oh shit. Hey, that's... 
Yeah, Faye and Ellie haven't seen this fucking thing in forever. Since, like, way before Kislev. That ship! What? What's wrong? That's the Yggdrasil! Isn't that Bart's ship? Yeah, he's still alive, all right. We can't just sit here. Let's go. Go where? To help! What else? Without a gear. Huh. Hold your horses. Doc, this is the bridge. How are our guests' gears? The repairs will be done shortly. Two minutes. Huh? Finish in two minutes. Then take them out through the supply entrance to the deck. Yes, sir. Your gears are being moved to the deck. Go get them. If you need, you can buy equipment at the supply entrance shop. What are you saying, Captain? If we get that, if we get bombed while we're caught up in the middle of a fight, be quiet. Our guests are fighting to save their friends. Don't get in the way. If we don't help, it'll tarnish the men of the sea's good name. Uh, yes, sir. But the Thames itself will not join in any fights. <laughs> Thanks. That's more than enough. Damn, I like the captain. He's pretty, uh, he's pretty laid back about everything. Maybe a little bit too laid back. <laughs> oh god, maybe he shouldn't be getting himself involved with us. Anyone who gets in themselves involved with Faye and the crew seems to end up in some shitty situations. <laughs> uh, supply entrance, I guess. And, uh, apparently we can pick up some parts here, too. If I remember... S yeah, I remember some stuff. I remember where stuff is. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. As much as I'm a little bit delirious on the story parts sometimes, my brain remembers every location. <laughs> like it was just there. So, I guess we need to upgrade Weltall and Vierge for now. Uh, let me see here. What do we all got? I'm just gonna buy some of these for now. Um, to not. <clears throat> Damn, shit's, shit is getting expensive. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I guess I got no choice though, do I? I gotta upgrade. Uh, god, I don't know which one I should get. I guess this one? Okay, Vierge, you're next. I think I'm going to give you the ether one, though. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to leave the engine for now. She seems to be pretty, pretty good with the fuel. Yeah, why does she have more fuel than Faye, though? Huh, I don't know. <laughs> it looks like we're all good now, though. Ah, maybe I should upgrade these guys, but I don't want to because we don't really need them right now. Uh, screw it. <laughs> We're gonna leave the rest for now. We're just gonna upgrade Weltall and Vierge. Maybe later on if I decide to go get some more money, then... Oh wait, I got a chest. It just like fell from the sky. Oh yeah, I don't need to do no job. <laughs> You're gonna get chased after the by the boss man if you don't start working. Uh, God damn. Where am I going again? <laughs> I gotta go get the gears. Is there someone I gotta talk to around here? 
This is the supply entrance. This is where all the treasure, armor, and other materials are brought up from the sea. Well, yeah, clearly. Nah, I don't want to listen to your problems. I got my own problems to listen to. He's always drinking in the middle of the day. <laughs> You're sailors, are you not? You're the men of the sea. You have a beer hall right by your bridge. I don't know. Drinking seems to be the norm around here. Oh, is that all we had to do? Just go in that door? All right. Here's our gears. Um, wait, what are we at? Are we at 20 minutes, 21 minutes? I think I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Uh, I'm going to go make some coffee and shit. And then I'll come back for another episode. I don't know. Uh, I don't feel like exactly jumping into this next part, like, this minute. <laughs> I want to get up for a little bit and uh, do some shit first. And then I'll come back for some more. So, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next episode when we uh, hop in our gears and go deal with this... Uh, bullshit with Calvana and Dominion. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Peace.